What's new in Awaken OS version 1.5.1 based on Android 11 running on the Xiaomi Poco F1? Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you what is new in Awaken OS version 1.5.1 based on Android 11 running on the Xiaomi Poco F1. Now we have been following Awaken OS ever since the first release for the Poco F1. And in case you want to learn how to install this ROM, have a look at the features of previous builds, links to all of those can be found in the description of this video. Now, as you can see, I am running 1.5.1 official build which is of course maintained by Cycron on my POCO F1 and the first change you will notice is that the security patch has been updated to January 5th 2021 the kernel is silver core version 8.0 build is from Friday January 15th AC Linux of course is set as enforcing the first bug fix in this build is that when you access styles and wallpapers from your home screen, it doesn't crash anymore. And yes, Awaken OS does have the Pixel 5 exclusive Mandalorian wallpapers baked in. And before you ask me which build am I using, I am using the vanilla build with Nix Google Apps on top of it. Another bug fix is that Hey Google now works and surprise surprise hey google works even when the screen is off so the issue where in hey google would not work with the screen off has been fixed next change you will find is in settings and then we can go into sound and if you go into your phone ringtone you will see you now have the option of pixel sounds and the same applies for your notification sound as well so pixel sounds have been added in this latest build of awaken os next change you will find is in awaken settings go into themes scroll down and you can now customize the rounded corners so either you can use framework values or let us say increase this to the maximum as you can see the rounded corners changed and let us switch it back to framework values because that is what works best but in case you want to adjust it you do have the option next up if you go into quick settings you can now move the brightness slider to the bottom right now as you can see it is on the top let us enable this toggle access the quick settings one more time bam there it is the slider has now moved to the bottom next up we can go into miscellaneous and you will see you have a new toggle to allow signature spoofing which is going to allow apps to bypass security systems by pretending to be a different application next up we can check for safety net so as you can see right now my device is not rooted i have only installed magisk manager to check for safety net and as you can see on your screen right now safety net is passing without any issues evaluation type is basic and this means that you should be able to use your banking apps without any issues and if you go into play store settings you will see that device is certified here as well then we can check for widewine support so here it is drm info widewine is l1 however unfortunately when i do go into prime video and try to download a movie the best size you can see is 0 0.96 gb and if i try to play this movie you will see that i do not have the hd text here at the bottom near the timeline which means that widewine l1 is not working and you do know who to blame for that it is not the rom you need to blame poco india for that in terms of youtube media playback there are no jitters no lags in youtube media playback everything works absolutely fine live caption works picture in picture works do note that picture in picture mode is either going to work if you are in a specific country or you have to pay for youtube premium in terms of app opening animations here it is you can see on your screen right now app opening animations pretty smooth no jitters no lags google feed in the building here it is no jitters and no lags in the google feed as well 
then we can check our recents as you can see everything is of course super fast and super smooth there are no jitters and no lags and before i forget they have also added the notification volume slider to specific volume panels so for starters you can go into settings sound and make sure that ring and notification volumes are not linked then we can go into settings awaken settings themes and if you choose your volume panel style as either aosp or compact and now when you access your volume panel there it is you can see you have a new slider for your notification volumes as well which is this one with the message sign at the bottom and those of you who do like to use google assistant make sure you go into settings then you'll go into apps and notifications default apps make sure that the digital assistant app is set as google then you go into the settings and do try to enable voice match by going into voice match and enable this toggle once you do that it should ask you to train the voice model and then hey google should be working fine without any issues and there it is peeps that is what was new in awaken os version 1.5.1 based on android 11 running on the xiaomi poco f1 and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you